Welcome back guys, it's Kids Coding Playground here, and today we're back for another video, and um, we are working on the Lunar New Year project. So, this, um, Chinese New Year is about coming, uh, so I'm pretty sure that uh, in Chinese New Year, people give envelopes and money inside envelopes and red envelopes to give to other people, and they get money, so yeah. So, I think this year's one is a bull. Yeah, so we decided to do the bowl right here. We made a Chinese New Year game. So can we all appreciate how cool this bowl looks? And it has all this wavy hair and it's really good graphics. So whenever you touch a red envelope, you gain uh, pick random one to 10 of, of money. So, and then, yeah, so it's basically collecting envelopes. And if you die, you see those firecrackers? They put like a little sprite on you, and that means you got hurt. So, uh, if you can hear me, that's good. So there's the firecracker, and I only have one life left, and it's on top right. So, I'm gonna have to get killed. So it says, sorry you lost, and everything stops. So, anyways, I have to tell you some stuff. Um, so first, if, uh, many people are they said that they have to request access for the sprites. And honestly, um, the way to do it is use your, not use your school account, use your mom or dad's account or your account, like your home account, but not your school account. So if you go in your school account, they'll have to tell you to request access. But if you don't have that, um, you can do that. And if you do not understand, you can watch our Google sprites, uh, video links in the description. So yeah. And we also have other cows, links in the description from the Google Drive. And on this tab, I just switched it. So there's this cow. Oh, so I'm going to play it. So it shows the graphics of all the moving cows. These don't move. So you can use any of these cows. But I, I wanted this one. This one looks the coolest, like all the hair graphics. So, yeah, you can take any of these links in the description this blue one looks cool too it's waving its tail and it's running this one is pretty cool the ones that don't move are still cool but you know you can i prefer the ones that are moving so uh let's get started so anyways let's keep on going so people told me to teach more slower so i mean like i'm gonna teach a little bit slower i have everything in my Backdrop, so I have this, which is the backdrop, all uh, right here, I have that, and then I also have the sound, so uh, the music, the Chinese music, so that's basically the music, and uh, I don't need this right, I'm going to put the Bolt the firecracker thing. You can um, go down the Google Drive links in the description. And I also have the firecracker, the red envelope, and the bowl. Let's reorganize everything. Is it loading? Oh, it's over there. So let's reorganize this. It just takes a while because you have a bunch of costumes. So first, let's work on the bowl. So the bowl is the most important, it's the star of this project. So when the green flag is clicked, uh, let's make it go to around here. And then so set rotation style to left, right. So it won't flip over while it's moving to the left nor the right. Um, and I'll switch costume to bowl one, which is the first one. So I'll switch costume to bowl. How much costumes does this thing have? 132 costumes, yeah. I'm, um, yeah, 32 costumes. Anyways, never mind. Uh, let, let's just keep them going. So it'll set money. So let's make a new variable. Money. Set money to zero, and it'll set our lives, lives, plural, um, 
to five because five is a good number for lives i don't know why it's just a good number and it'll have a forever loop this is the movement to make it look very wavy so it, it depends on what cow you're using if it's a, like a different cow um and it's moving then you might have to add some seconds into it so yeah one forever if then the key left arrow click then it will point in direction 90 i mean negative 90 90 is right negative 90 move 10 steps and next costume I duplicate that to make right arrow just like that changes the right arrow point direction 90 at this time and then move 10 steps next costume so we're gonna work on the red envelope yet next next so has some code and so when the green flag is clicked it'll go to a random position it will set Y to 180. So 180. Forever and ever and ever. I uh, change Y by minus five. And there's an if then. So if then you need one of these symbols, if then the Y position is less than negative 170, then it'll, then it'll go back up because 170 is down here. So when it the Y position is less than that, then it will go back up. So it'll go to random position And set Y to 180. Just duplicate this. Oopsies. Duplicate right here. All I need is that thing. Uh, set Y to 180. And you need an if then statement. Let's make this a little bit smaller so I can see better. If then it's touching the bolt, you'll get money. So touching. Bull. Bull one. I'll start sound. Boop, 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 boop. They have it for every single sprite. I don't know why. Except Scratch Cat. I think she, he has one meow. So it'll change money by pick random one to ten. So it's a random amount of money. Because sometimes some people give you like 20 bucks, some people give you like 100. So, but this is one to ten. And I'll go to a random position and set Y to one eighty. So I can just do this. Uh, right there. And then we're gonna work on the firecracker next. So, the firecracker has quite some code. So it has a decent amount of code. So let's start. So when the green flag is clicked. That's good enough to Need one out. It will go to a random position. Anywhere random. It will set Y to 180. Um, forever. It will change Y by minus 5. So keep on going down and down. And you need an if then statement. If then, if the if the y position is less than negative one hundred seventy, then it will. Yeah, you go with the y position. Then it will 
hide. Go to a random position. And set Y to 180. After that, oh wait, I pick random a second, so. Wait, pick random one to five seconds, and then I'll spawn in again if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Uh, one to five seconds, and I'll show. So, our next trip to code is. And then the bowl, if it's touching the bowl. I'll broadcast firecracker hit bowl. So this is the, like the main component of broadcasts. Oopsies. What is this called again? Yeah, firecracker hit bowl. Firecracker hit bowl. And after that, it'll hide. A hide. It'll go to a random position. It'll set Y to 180. And I'll wait a pick random a second. So, wait, pick random one to five seconds. We can just duplicate this. And it'll show. Now we have to uh, do the sprite one, which is really, really simple. And we also have to do the pull. So let's actually do the pull first. So I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you this. So the bull, the envelope, the firecracker. So if my money's going up, like 16, 24. So pick random and then the firecracker isn't doing anything quite yet. So let's just um, continue. The bowl. So when I receive firecracker hit the bowl, it will change life by minus one. So now you can start losing lives. And they'll start sound snare beatbox. I think this one works. Yeah, this one. Um, the snare beatbox. It'll switch costume to bull one. Bull. So, and now, it'll do, if then, the life equals zero. Then it will stop other scripts in the sprite. It will say, sorry, you lost. Because you did lose, so. Um, say, sorry, you lost. For one second. Now stop all. And now we have to work on the sprite one. So when the green flag is clicked, It'll go to the front layer, the front most front. Go to the front layer, hide, and go forever and ever and ever, and go to bull. So it's already at the bull. And now if the firecracker hits the bull, it will show here wait one second and then hide and now we have to put in the music so so um i'm let's test out the so i'm gonna actually show you how to draw sprite one first if you don't want to use hours links in the description but if you think ours is not as good as what you can do, you can uh, uh, draw your own. So let's paint it. So you need thickness five. So you can 
Yeah, so uh, let's just draw. So you can skip you can skip a lot if you don't want to draw and you want to do your own. So it's just a bunch of messed up lines everywhere. So that's basically how explosions are. Not really. Um, so if you can skip to a certain position if you do not want to watch me draw. Well, I mean, like, it's really quick, so... Yeah, it's basically the explosion. We have to color it yellow, so we already have it in yellow. Yeah, so I'm just going to delete this. And we can also reshape it, too. Make some larger than others. Why not? So, yeah, that's basically the explosion. So let's delete this costume. And now let's add in the music. So when the green flag is clicked, it'll set volume to 25%. 25%. This is abnormally large. So forever. I'll play sound Chinese music. I think I already uploaded that in the beginning. Yeah. So let's test it out. Say sorry you lost it says that and then we're done we're done with this project so the the thing is to get as much uh score as you can so anyways uh we're done so oh yeah i forgot this oh yeah like and subscribe before you go and share and also comment in the comment section below how much money you got from chinese new year if you do celebrate it so anyways yeah like subscribe and share now right now click the buttons i am a head out